Now at five, four dollars. That's what a jury just awarded to a local family after a deputy shot and killed their loved one. CBS 12's Chuck Weber is live in Fort Pierce where members of the community are preparing to protest that jury decision. Chuck? Yeah, Liz, right over here, take a look. People are starting together for this march that will get underway here very shortly. The plan is to march from this park in the south end of Fort Pierce up US-1 to the federal courthouse where this jury decision, controversial jury decision, came down a few weeks ago. The nation is looking at us. Fort Pierce City Commissioner Reginald Session organizing a response to a jury verdict now in the national spotlight. It centers around the fatal shooting of Gregory Hill Jr. by St. Lucie County Sheriff's Deputy Christopher Newman responding to a loud music complaint. The garage door opened revealing Hill inside. A second deputy yelled Hill had a gun. Deputy Newman now says he saw Hill with the firearm. Then the garage door closed. Deputy Newman fired four times through the garage door killing Hill. It just doesn't make sense that individuals would be fearful of their life if there was a, a door between them and the alleged perpetrated. Hill's family sued and the case went before a jury last month here in federal court in Fort Pierce. The verdict, jurors cleared Deputy Newman, found Sheriff Ken Mascara 1% liable, but ruled Hill, under the influence of alcohol, was 99% responsible for his own death. Then jurors awarded just $4 to Hill's three children and for funeral expenses. It would have been better off saying zero. But to say such a nominal amount on an individual's life is certainly an injustice. CBS 12 was first to report the verdict. National news outlets picked up the story. When you read the articles, uh, New York Times, Washington Post, uh, CNN, the nation is saying, what's going on? So what are we going to do here? Back to our live picture now as this march is about ready to get underway. The attorney representing Hill's family has told me he will likely appeal that verdict and will be here for the march. Live in Fort Pierce, Chuck Weber, CBS 12 News. Chuck, thank you. New